Welcome to this deep dive into aviation history. Today, we'll explore the Tupolev Tu-144, the world's first commercial aircraft to break Mach 2. Developed during the Cold War, this supersonic jet rivaled the iconic Concorde, pushing the boundaries of speed and engineering in passenger aviation. The Tupolev Tu-144 was developed by the Soviet Union as a response to the British-French Concorde program. First flown in 1968, it was the world's first supersonic passenger jet, preceding Concorde by two months. The Tu-144 was designed to showcase Soviet technological prowess during the Cold War, aiming to dominate the future of commercial aviation. The aircraft's design featured delta wings, four powerful engines, and a distinctive retractable nose to improve visibility during landing. It was capable of cruising at Mach 2, twice the speed of sound, making it the fastest passenger aircraft of its time. However, development was rushed, leading to numerous technical challenges, including safety concerns and high operational costs. In 1973, a tragic crash during the Paris Air Show damaged the Tu-144's reputation. Despite this, the aircraft briefly entered commercial service in 1977, flying a limited route between Moscow and Almaty. Unfortunately, reliability issues, noise levels, and high fuel consumption led to the suspension of passenger flights after just 55 total missions. The Tu-144's legacy continued when a modified version, the Tu-144LL, was used in the 1990s by NASA for supersonic flight research. While it never achieved the same commercial success as Concorde, the Tu-144 remains a symbol of Soviet innovation and ambition in the race for supersonic passenger travel. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the incredible history of the Tupolev Tu-144. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more fascinating stories about aviation's most iconic aircraft.